Take a wee look. I don't. Oh, you motherfucker! Look at you, never fucking moved! Okay, so where shall we start? Now I understand it's been almost a week since I uploaded last and I feel the need to explain. Not that I have a specific upload schedule or anything, it's it's basically whenever I can. But my last commentary I wasn't in a good mood for various reasons and unfortunately that continued for a few days after and I found myself in an unknown place. Now usually I get angry and get over it quite quickly, but this was beyond anger. This was bordering on hatred. And on Monday, I actually sat down in front of my computer and did a commentary. And I sat and edited it and rendered it. And I didn't upload it. Because I have always said to myself, do not be that guy. Don't do a commentary that involves hate towards someone or shows emotions that may come back and bite you in the ass at a later stage. So I chose not to upload it. Now if any of you guys follow me on Twitter, I have been quite, we'll say, up in arms about a certain issue that I'm not going to discuss in this commentary, or any commentary, or forever for that matter, because, well to be honest, I don't do drama. I leave that up to the soaps on TV, or the clowns on YouTube. I had a few direct messages over the weekend on Twitter, and some were, were quite strongly worded. Uh, telling me to fuck up or fuck off. Actually, that's what I might entitle this commentary. <laughs> and funny enough, I'd actually say the same. <laughs> if I saw someone getting angry over social media or getting all emotional and getting their little panties in a twist, I'd say the exact same thing. So I did. I fucked right off and played some video games and had fun. And actually, I found myself playing the PS3 with my five-year-old son over the past few days, and it's, you know what, not to sound too corny, it's been such an amazing feeling to see the joy and excitement back in my games room. It's been missed sorely. We have been playing DuckTales Remastered on the PS3, and, and even some Minecraft, and messing around in Gotham in Arkham City, and it just reminded me of of how good gaming can be and, and it kind of got me back into enjoying gaming and opening up my mind to other games. Now believe it or not, and I've said this in, in previous commentaries, I grew up a gamer and played everything and anything I could get my little hands on until Call of Duty came along and sucked me into this gaming rut we'll call it, where we all know just one more game becomes two hours. Actually for me it's like you know what, I think I'll just get this new game, um, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 on the PS3, and yeah, I think I'll have a few games. And yeah, it's been six years later, and here I am, eagerly awaiting Black Ops 3. Where the fuck is that time gone? But anyway, back, back to me getting a right kick up the arse over Twitter, which to be fair, I did need. I just want to say I don't usually get sucked into confrontation or drama or let my anger get the better of me. Yes, I know I'm passionate and whatnot. I think I should actually keep my rage and anger for my tantrums of a grown man. And actually, speaking of tantrums of a grown man, I do have a new one coming soon. Well, hopefully if I get the time over the next few days to edit it. I actually found it while looking for gameplay for this video. I had almost forgotten about it, so hopefully it turns out okay when I finally get round to doing that. So I suppose that's something to look forward to. And while I'm on the subject of gameplay, I think I should explain a little about the gameplay you're watching in the background. Well, it's Call of Duty Ghosts, of course, on the map. Stonehaven? <laughs> I know, I honestly don't think I've ever seen anyone upload this map to YouTube. Because it's fucking shite. So, we'll say. That's a YouTube first, <laughs> for me anyway. But I only got this gameplay last night while I was in a live stream with Gary from Gillespie Gaming and Lowstock Gamer, who didn't actually realise <laughs> while playing this game he was in the opposing team until my battle hind had killed him a few times. And actually, I just remember him saying, What the fuck? How has your battle hind killed me? Oh, wait, you're in the opposite team? Ah, oh, shite. Ah, oh, Steve, you silly little goose. Now, I know this obviously has been quite a quick little commentary, and I don't really have anything else to talk about. Well, I do, but we'll leave it for another commentary. <laughs> this has possibly been my quickest commentary ever. 
you know, sometimes it's just good to get in and out and job done. Although my wife won't agree with that. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to take it there. I just had to take it to the gutter. That just had to be said. It was there to be said, so you know what? If, if I didn't say it, I'm sure someone would write it in the comment section anyway. So this has been a, a newly reformed good mood XZ007. I'm going to see you all in the next video and just before I go, Star Wars Battlefront gameplay coming soon. Love you, bye.